Yeah, hello guys. Hello guys! Yeah, that was lie. I was kidding. I'm always up there. So this is Eric again from Eric Novita channel. And guess what I'm gonna be cooking? Well, doesn't that say it in the title anyway? Yes, I'm cooking Tom Yum Soup. Tom Yum Goom for the first time. So, well, not really first time because I'm using this paste with other ingredients, but it's a good try. So I bought a lot, a lot of ingredients from the local Asian market, you know, including lemongrass, which is really hard to find in Korea, and also some shallot. Okay, did you uh, salute to shallot? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, so I'm gonna cook tom yum gung for the first time. So I've never tried. You know, tom yum gung is really popular in Korea, but it's really expensive. So I might as well just try to cook for myself and try it. So let's begin. Yay! So I'm guessing first thing first I need to do the ingredients I guess So I have some lemongrass and onions and shrimp Only 5 shrimp because they are freaking expensive in Korea And some squid and this mushroom So first thing first I'm gonna cut up the ingredients Actually while I'm doing that I'm gonna boil some water So this is what I'm doing with like the squid. I'm cutting them into this diamond pieces. How do I say it? Like this, I'm making some cuts, cuts in my squid so that when they boil, they can actually shrink inside. And onions! Onions! So the description is saying that I need to put four, uh, put 500 ml of water and then two tablespoons of the rosy menu and shrimp and mushroom. But since I have vegetables and more water, I'm gonna put four tablespoons of this. I can already I can already smell the tom yum smell and lemongrass. Very <laughs> lemongrass. This is so tough. Okay. <laughs> Why does it already taste like tom yum gum? The power of MSG and the this uh, tom yum gum rosy menu. Okay. And I'm gonna put lots of vegetables like onions, like, like a lot. And speed. Speed in the speed. <laughs> Squid in and shrimp, shrimp, shallot, shallot, and I have a question: What I do with this root of this lemongrass? Like, I guess I have to put it now. Oh, it smells amazing! It's good spices. And since I really like it spicy, I'm gonna put some Vietnamese dried pepper. Like a lot. I'm gonna season it more with fish sauce. Oh. Mm. It's good. But I like it spicy, so I'm gonna put more pepper powder. And towards the end, I'm gonna put this mushroom. I like mushrooms, so maybe like half of it. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna split this into another bowl and then put coconut cream so that I can make it into a creamy style. So let's see.
It's like ice cream. Oh, when I added cocoa cream, I knew instantly that I have to make it into like creamy style. It's way better. Anything creamy is good. Wow. So how was it guys? That was it for my tom yum soup, tom yum gung and I'm gonna try the creamy style and the non-creamy style so let me know what you guys think and I'll show you how I eat it Thank you so much and if you really like my video and if you enjoy me cooking different dishes please subscribe to my channel because you never know what I'm gonna be cooking I might be cooking something crazy and I also teach you Korean so please subscribe and I'll see you all next time after you watching me eating and other videos. Okay, see you guys. See you guys. This is the one with out cream. This is the one without the cream. Hmm. Actually, pretty good. Unexpected, but good. Ah, uh, mm. kind of tastes like Korean food, champong, which is like spicy noodle, like si spicy seafood noodle. Mm. I like it. I just wish I had more mm, like fresh ingredients, like fresh cilantro. And this one, creamy one, so good. Okay. I'm surprised. I don't know. So, if so, if there are any Thai people in my channel, please let me know whether I made it correctly or not. And welcome all the feedback. So, I really appreciate your amazing food from Thailand. So, thank you. And I'm gonna devour this food. Okay, so, see you all next time.